An ill omen. How did that charcoal get spilled? Lot of blood. Where's the body? Someone went over it. Blood. Still fresh. Such a mess. This is where you are hidden. I cannot leave you here. I will take you back to Peleus for the proper rites. Poor Ruia. If you had only known how to make such a leap. What did you get yourself into? Beasts with the faces of men prey on the weak and powerless. We cannot simply show our bellies to the jackals that plague our land. By the gods! Ruya! What happened? She was thrown to her death from the Pigeon Tower. Your letter. Why was she killed? That is the badge worn by Dimnos, our master of arms. Why did she have it? 
I will find out soon enough. You poor, poor girl. May you walk in the field of reeds. Dimnos, I'm looking for Ruya. Perhaps because she has your badge. Shit. Well, she was just an Egyptian dog. No matter. Why did you do it? Truth? I didn't mean to kill her. Only teach her a lesson for her insolence. She refused to read a letter for me. You must confess to Peleus. I suppose you want the same fate as Ruya. You stupid Egyptian. I'll teach you the same lesson she learned. Come, try. <laughs> You will pay, Corpse. Hmm. The letter he mentioned. Was it Dimnos? Yes. He killed Ruia out of base cruelty. And he died because he thought I was also less than a person. What a senseless tragedy. She was a smart girl with a good heart. Shout! Hello, friend. Come to trade? Can I help you? Come back often. Heresy is a shit.
afraid I must borrow this. Where are you? Nothing I haven't dealt with before. Hey, what? Hang on. attack on site here. Come 
almost as good with that as you are with the plow, right? Careful you don't overfill the jars. I seek the master brewer, Hakuf. I have no time. Speak to one of my overseers if you must. You misunderstand. I am a Magi. Apollodorus sent me. Apollodorus, of course. He sent me for the scarab, the shadow that darkens eyes. Shh, please. That is an evil name to speak aloud. Apollodorus knows the people are suffering. In my position, many confide in me. Trade is strangled, the soldiers run rampant, and the weight of Ptolemy's taxation crushes the breath from us. Come with me. Let us retire where we have a roof overhead. And Harriet, you have your home. Master Tahaka's wife is so kind. I cannot thank the gods enough for delivering. There are many terrible stories about the scarab. I am sure Apollodorus told you. Tales of mutilation, disappearances, and folk buried in the desert and left to die. A horrendous fate, trapped in the shimmering sand, your mind and body pounded by the remorseless sun, waiting for the final release into the duat. But these are only stories. There are real villains in size. But the Scarab, if he exists, it is not safe to speak of him. The investigations of Haku's agents, concerns of the people, ah. Saez is no different than Siwa.
The last man who asked questions about the scarab was near beaten to death, with his tongue cut out. Mm. Who was he? Old Gupa, father-in-law to the most powerful man in the region, Tahaka. That boy, Kawab, is his grandson. Hey, you tired of winning? I'm looking for your grandfather. Do you know where he went? No. He left on the road to Camp Piros. He should have been home by now. I'll see if I can find him along the road. Decision, <laughs> <laughs> 